I'm going to hypnotize you through the screen in this video. And if you've seen some of my other videos, you know that this is the third hypnosis through the screen video that I've done. That being said, these aren't in any particular order. So you can watch this one first and then go back and watch my other ones. Or if you've seen the other ones and now you're ready for this one, great. But either way, we're going to do some new things that I haven't done in the previous videos, especially things that have been heavily requested. I will hypnotize you in this video to think that I am invisible, to think that I'm your favorite celebrity. We are going to do that in this video, so make sure that you stick around, check it out, stick around. Of course, you're already in this video, which is why you clicked on it in the first place. So of course, you're hopefully going to stick around. Make sure you subscribe too if you haven't done that. And by the way, again, shameless plug, if you enjoy the video before you've even watched it. Anyways, that, that's, what am I saying? Let's just jump right into it. I'm going to hypnotize you right now. I'm not going to do too much of an intro because that's boring. You want to get hypnotized, so that's what we're going to do, all right? The only thing I'm going to say is this will not work if you don't allow it to work, all right? Let it work. Give yourself permission to allow the state to work. It's not mind control. It's not magic. It's not just going to happen all on its own. But the way it'll happen is by giving yourself permission to allow it to happen. Let my voice become your voice. Let your voice become my voice. Your internal voice becomes what I say. All right, let yourself become so focused on me and nothing else. So if you need to, put on some headphones, go to a quiet room where you can be by yourself and immerse yourself completely and totally in this experience and nothing else, okay? Don't think, don't be in your own head. The more you're in your head, the less you're in the experience. So just tune out any other thoughts, focus only on my voice and let my voice become your thoughts in a way and this will work great, all right? So let's just jump right into it. Look right here, look right into my eyes if you will. Look in my eyes, let yourself take a deep breath in and breathe out and close your eyes. Now, as your eyes are closed, focus only on my voice and nothing else. And as you focus on my voice, let yourself get relaxed. Now, every muscle, every nerve, every fiber of your body relaxes now. Relax deeper, now relax further. Now, every sound helps you relax now. Every word helps you relax now. Every breath helps you relax now. That's right, as you focus only on my voice and nothing else. My voice becomes your thoughts. Your thoughts become my voice. Nothing else matters but my voice. As you relax even deeper, take all of that amazing relaxation and double it now, even more relaxed where you are right now. And in this state, feeling amazing, feeling incredible, relax deeper now and let yourself just sleep. And when I say that word sleep, you know you're not falling asleep. You're just letting yourself get as relaxed as you possibly can as if you were asleep, but where your mind becomes totally awake to only my voice and nothing else. As you let yourself sleep, relax even deeper, even further now. Tune out any other distractions, any other noises. Sleep. That's right. Focus on nothing else but my voice as you sleep. All that amazing relaxation. And as you focus on my voice, I want you to focus on the sensation of the relaxation in your eyelids. Focus on your eyelids. Let your eyelids get so relaxed and so heavy, they become so relaxed and so heavy, they become stuck and they will not and cannot open. And you'll notice that the more you try to open your eyes, the more stuck and heavy they get. And notice what happens. If you try to open your eyes, try to open them and find they're stuck, they're heavy, they can't, they won't open no matter what. They're completely stuck shut. Now, in fact, you can stop trying to open them and continue to relax them now. Relax your rest of your entire body now, even deeper, slowly, even deeper, all the way down now. That's right. And I want you to imagine that feeling of relaxation that was in your eyes a moment ago is now spread to your entire body now. Your entire body is so relaxed it feels stuck. Your entire body is so relaxed it feels heavy. So heavy it's become completely stuck now. And what you'll notice is if you were to try to move any part of your body right now, you become just so stuck and heavy, so stiff and rigid you can't move at all, no matter what. Completely stuck, completely heavy, completely stiff. Now, as you relax deeper and further now, and just sleep, no longer stuck, no longer heavy, but relax even deeper all the way down, that amazing state of relaxation. And in this state, any belief, any suggestion, any idea that I give you, instantaneously and immediately becomes your unquestioned reality. We focus only on my voice and nothing else. 
That's right. And in this state, relax deeper now. Sleep now even deeper all the way down that incredible state of relaxation focus. And next time that you open your eyes, you're going to find that the strangest thing has happened is that next time you open your eyes, for some reason, you cannot remember your age. You cannot remember how old you are or when you were born, your birthday. You, when, you're, when you try to remember, you just think of numbers, but you're not sure if they're the right numbers or how old or what day you were born on. But you completely forget your age, your birthday, how old you are next time you open your eyes. You can't remember it. The more you try to remember it, the more that you forget it. And the further it gets from your mind, you completely forget your age and your birthday next time you open your eyes. Go ahead and just shove one, two, three, eyes open, awake, doing great, doing good. Now, you notice that feeling before of your eyes becoming stuck and heavy and your body becoming stuck and stiff and rigid and heavy. But the interesting thing is, notice what happens if I ask you to try to think of your age. How old were you? Or how old are you? Notice that you can't. Notice that for some reason you can't think of how old you are. If you were to try to think of your birthday, you can't remember that either. You forget even further. I know it's a really strange feeling, isn't it? That a piece of information you might have known, or that you know that you know now that you don't know, even though you know you know, you don't right now. For the strangest reason, you forget. But that's right, just look right at me and sleep. Eyes closed all the way back down that amazing state of relaxation, even deeper as you sleep even further now. And next time you open your eyes, your birthday, your age, how old you are has returned. You can remember it as you always will be able to. However, next time that you open your eyes, you're going to find that for the strangest reason, you can't speak. Any words that come out of your mouth just become stuck in your mouth and your throat. You just Any words that come out just can't come out. You might be able to make an audible sound perhaps, but words can't be formed. Words cannot come out of your mouth next time you open your eyes. You're going to find that you cannot speak for the strangest reason next time you open your eyes. One, two, three, awake, eyes open, doing great. And that was kind of a cool experience, wasn't it? You actually forgot your birthday or how old you are. But now notice what happens. You can rem remember your age now, right? But what if you were to try to say your age? Your age is, you notice that. Notice that as you try to say it, you can't, it just won't come out. The words won't form for the strangest reason. It's kind of cool, kind of strange experience that you get to give yourself in this state of hypnosis. But just let yourself focus on me and sleep. Eyes closed all the way back down, even deeper, even deeper, even deeper. More relaxed now. Focus only on my voice now. Nothing else matters but my voice now. All the way back down. And next time that you open your eyes, you can speak as you always would be able to. Your words form completely naturally and normally. But relax deeper now. All the way down. That's right. As you continue to immerse yourself in this state, the more you hear my voice, the deeper that you go. And the deeper that you go, the more you hear my voice relaxing all the way, this incredible state of relaxation and focus. And next time you open your eyes, you're going to find that the strangest thing has happened. Next time you open your eyes, everything is suddenly upside down. I look upside down on the screen. Everything around you and your room looks upside down. Nothing is scary or unsafe or alarming at all, but it's just cool and strange that for the for some reason, somehow, everything has been flipped upside down. I'm upside down on the screen. Everything around you is upside down next time you open your eyes. Go to the show. One, two, three. Awake. Eyes open. That's kind of strange, isn't it? That in a moment ago, is right side up, but now something else has happened. And even look around the room, if you will. If you look around the room, notice that. Isn't that kind of strange? How everything looks a little bit different, doesn't it? I know it's not how it usually looks, but that's part of the state of hypnosis, is you allow your mind to get to that point where everything is not quite how it always seems, by letting an idea become so real that you experience it like it's real. And that's what hypnosis is about. As you look right at me, and sleep, eyes closed all the way back down, that amazing state of relaxation. Next time you open your eyes, everything is right side up, no longer upside down. Everything is now completely back to normal next time you open your eyes. However, the next time you open your eyes, I want you to think of your very favorite celebrity, the person you've always wanted to meet, talk to, person you've looked up to for such a long time. Think of somebody other than myself that you've been a fan of, that you would really, really want to meet. And next time you open your eyes, I have suddenly become that person. I look like, I sound like, I am now your very favorite celebrity on this video. And next time you open your eyes, you'll suddenly believe that 
the hypnosis video is interrupted to turn into a video shout out from your very favorite celebrity. I have now become your favorite celebrity. Next time you open your eyes, go and let yourself one, two, three, awake. Eyes open. Hey there. How's it going? Just wanted to make this special video just for you. I know you've been a fan for a long time. I want to say thank you for following me and for supporting my journey. It really means a lot to me. It means way more than you know. I know you're probably freaking out a little bit excited about this right now, but I wanted to make this special video, a little intermission in the middle of the hypnosis, just for you to tell you how awesome you are. Your support, again, truly means the world to me. And I know that you look up to me, but I want you to know that I wouldn't be possible to do what I do without the support of my fans like you. So truly thank you so much again from the bottom of my heart for all of your support, for everything that you've done for me and for my career and my journey. Again, it really means more than you know. So you are awesome. You're destined for huge things. You're such a rock star. So thank you so much for your support. You're amazing. So go ahead and look right here for me, actually, and sleep, eyes closed, all the way back down that amazing state of relaxation, even deeper, even further. That's right. Next time you open your eyes, I am no longer that celebrity on that video shout out. Everything is now returned back to normal in every single way. Sleep even deeper, even further, all the way back down. Next time you open your eyes, I am no longer that celebrity. Everything is normal. However, next time you open your eyes, any time that I snap my fingers and make that sound, I become completely invisible on the screen. I literally disappear and vanish, and all you can see is just the blank background behind me and nothing else. I become completely invisible when I snap my fingers. I reappear if I snap again but I literally disappear from the screen when I snap my fingers next time you open your eyes. Doing amazing, doing incredible. Go to the shelf, one, two, three. Awake, eyes open, doing good. All right, feeling great, feeling good. Now notice, look right, right here at me, right on the screen. And, but now watch this, you can see me here on the screen, but if I do this, and notice that you can't, and you can still hear me, but for the strangest reason, your mind doesn't process seeing me anymore. It's like I'm not there until I do this, and now I've reappeared again and you can see me normally. Isn't that kind of strange? Did you notice how your mind processed that where I was there and then I wasn't? Watch, you can see me, but now you can hear me, but no longer see me. Isn't that strange? Until I come back now, you can see me once more. But now check this out. This will be even stranger as next time I snap my fingers, I become invisible except for my head. My body becomes invisible, but you can only see my head like it's a floating head. Now, check it out. Isn't that kind of strange? Like a floating head on the screen. Yeah, I know kind of special effects, but it's kind of cool, isn't it? But watch, the rest of me reappears and now, and just like that, that was pretty neat, right? And I know it's probably cooler in person if you can see it, but because videos can always be video effects, right? But either way, you notice how your mind processed that a little bit differently. It processed what you thought was happening to the point that it created that projection of a new experience out of a belief. A belief that I was invisible or partially invisible or whatever it might have been was created in your experience, which is what hypnosis is all about. So focus right here and sleep. Eyes closed all the way back down that amazing state of relaxation, even deeper, even further now. Sleep all the way back down. I'm no longer invisible. You can always see me no matter what next time you open your eyes. However, next time you open your eyes, I want you to imagine any pain or discomfort, any physical pain, discomfort you might have been feeling either in this moment or in the past or earlier today, I want you to imagine that suddenly vanished, is gone now. I want you to imagine being completely pain free, feeling physically the best that you have felt all day, week, month, year, feeling so good. Any pain, any discomfort, any uneasiness you might have felt physically even before this video or during this video is just gone now feeling pain-free, and feel how good that feels. But we'll take that a step further. Beyond just how good you feel physically, I want you to think of any, any mental or emotional discomfort you might have felt as well, any anxiety, any depression, any fear, any worry, any stress. And imagine that's all gone now too, just gone. All that anxiety, the stress, the worry, it's just dissipated away, and you feel amazing physically amazing, mentally amazing, emotionally amazing, on cloud nine, feeling the best that you've ever felt, feeling so good as you continue to focus and relax and listen to just my voice. Just feel that. Feel how good 
this feels to be free. Free of any discomfort, physically, mentally, emotionally, just feeling amazing. And as you focus on my voice, in this peak amazing state that you're in right now, I want you to think of a decision. Think of a decision that maybe you know that you've been needing to make for a while but haven't made yet. Maybe it's a decision to let go of something. Maybe it's to let go of of unforgiveness, let go of resentment towards somebody, let go of a bad habit, let go of an addiction. Maybe it's a decision to love, to finally love yourself, to finally love someone else, to be willing to start a relationship, to be willing to be totally committed to the one that you're in. Maybe it's a decision to live, a decision to start living your life, a decision to start following your dreams. A decision to pursue your passion because life is way too short to be living somebody else's dream. Whatever that decision is, I don't know, but you know. I know exactly that you know the decision that you need to make is in your mind right now. And as you think about that decision that might have been a struggle to make in the past, or maybe you're still working through deciding, I want you to think of that decision but think of that decision as if it's just been decided now. That decision has been made now. See, because it's in your moments of decision that your destiny has been shaped. And by simply deciding to commit to whatever that decision is now, you know that going forward you can move in the direction that you need to to make that happen. See, because in our everyday waking state, we tend to just overanalyze, we overthink, we get stuck in our head, and we get stressed, and we get worried. But in this state, in this hypnotized state, none of that matters. There's no stress, there's no overthinking, there's no worry. There's just a decision. The decision that you made. And that after this video, a decision that you can now act upon. Act upon to make your life better and the lives of those around you better. Because that's what this is all about, is creating experiences that are not only fun and that are cool and that are enjoyable, but experiences to make your life better. And as you think about this decision and the way that the decision has been made, think about what's possible. And think about for a moment feeling that the future you will receive knowing that the present you just made this decision. Think about that. Feel that. Feel how proud the future you is of the present you for making the decision you just made. Own it. Because you made a decision that can change your life. That will change your life. Because again, it is in your moments of decision that your destiny is shaped. And the only person you are destined to be is the person you decide to be. The decisions that you decide to make, the decision you just decided to make, will shape your destiny into the way that you want it to be. That's right. That's right. And as you focus on me, back to me, back to my voice, focus on this feeling of amazing relaxation. That's right. And even after the state, a decision will stay with you, will stick with you. And maybe that decision will bring up more decisions that you know you'll need to continue to make. But whatever decision that you know you just made, can and will and just did, change your life. As you focus back on my voice now, and just that feeling of relaxation, and nothing else, in a moment, I'm going to count up from 1 to 5. Each number I count up from 1 to 5, feeling less relaxed, less hypnotized, and releasing yourself from this hypnotized state fully and completely when I reach that final number 5. But each number I count up, fully integrating that decision even more, fully integrating the enjoyment you had with this experience, fully integrating your ability to get hypnotized. As you start with the number 1, gathering up that amazing positive energy in your body into the number 2, that relaxation turning to more confidence, more energy into the number three, 
That's right, beginning to sit up or stand up straight and tall, feeling good into the number four, doing amazing, doing incredible as you get ready to release yourself from hypnotized state, preparing to open your eyes fully and completely at the final number five, eyes open, wide awake, doing amazing, doing incredible. All right, and that's it. I hope that experience was a lot of fun for you. I'd love to hear if it worked, if it didn't, what did you think? Leave a comment and let me know. I hope you enjoyed that video. And if you haven't seen the other hypnosis through the screen videos, again, this was more of the deeper hypnosis phenomena. So if, if everything didn't work as well, then maybe try one of the other videos first, which is some of the more, not lighter hypnosis, but some of the easier things to be able to experience. And then maybe come back to this one if it didn't work as well. But if it did, then so awesome. So excited you got to experience some of the deeper levels of hypnosis. But either way, I hope you enjoyed this video. So make sure that you subscribe if you enjoy the channel. If you want to see more, leave a comment with what other things I should hypnotize you to do in future hypnosis through the screen. Make sure you like that video and all that fun stuff. And yeah, that's it. My name's been Zach Pinsons. So thank you for tuning in. And until the next video, be great. And remember, the only person you're destined to become is the person that you decide to be.